Do you get a little weary sometimes? We all do. Well, there's a, a secret to having strength in times that are kind of wearisome. In the book of Hebrews, I encourage you to read, read the book of Hebrews uh, today or some portions of it anyway. Uh, chapters 11 and 12 are particularly inspiring. If you don't have time to read the whole book, you might just focus on those two chapters. Throughout this book, we're seeing how Christ is greater than anything else we can imagine. Jesus is greater than Moses. Jesus is greater than the law. His grace overcomes our sin. And in chapter 12, we see this book come to a crescendo uh, after we've heard about all these people, all these great saints of old who have lived by faith and conquered all kinds of obstacles and troubles and foes. Uh, and by their faith they overcame and we have this great cloud of witnesses that surrounds us and here's what the writer says therefore since we are surrounded by such a great cloud of witnesses let us throw off everything that hinders and the sin that so easily entangles and let us run with perseverance the race marked out for us fixing our eyes on Jesus the pioneer and perfecter of faith for the joy set before him, he endured the cross, scorning its shame, and sat down at the right hand of the throne of God. Consider him who endured such opposition from sinners, so that you will not grow weary and lose heart. Fix your eyes on Jesus today. He loves you. He's gone before you. He has suffered so much in order to give you strength, to give you life that we might endure faithfully following him. I'm praying for you on your journey, whatever you're struggling with. Uh, let me know if there's some way I can pray in particular for you. And I ask your prayers as well. Uh, may we follow faithfully on in the footsteps of Jesus this day and in the days ahead, right up until the day Jesus returns.